Here we are in West Kirby to have a look at this old photograph. And we have traveled the length and breadth of the peninsula to get here, to see how things have changed for the worse or for the better. Maybe you can decide and let us know down below. But we first, let's have a look at this one. Now, before we do look at that picture, uh, we found this picture here. Now, I believe this could be the late 70s, early 80s. If anyone can correct that, then that would be, that'd be great. Um, this is the same section of road here, which is on the picture. Now, a big difference here is there used to be the, a bridge that went over the railway line into the West Kirby Joint Station, which is now, of course, the Wirral Way. Um, after it closed, many years after it closed, the bridge was demolished, but we can still see that bridge in the picture. Also in the picture, you can see uh, down the bottom off to the left, uh, the flatter road, which is the current road, which is just about under construction. And um, must have been like the, the left-hand lane they've just completed at that point before they demolished the bridge. So you can see here a clear comparison of what the um, road is like before and after the bridge. Um, over on the right, you can still see those buildings over there, hidden by trees which have grown massively since then, of course. Uh, that white building on the right, uh, the two triangular shaped ones, is still there. And the Tudor looking building on the far left is, is still there. But the one in the middle used to have the um, brown and yellow brickwork and that's all been painted uh, white. Or well, part of it has been painted white uh, by the looks of it. But of course, that, this bridge that we're looking at led onto the branch line to the West Kirby Joint platform, uh, which we'll go and have a look now. So we have no obvious comparison pictures here at this point, but we'd have been literally right on the track looking underneath the bridge right here. And we can tell that because the Wirral Way, um, which was the track bed, is directly in front of us came underneath the bridge, so the road would have gone high enough to go over it and straight towards where we are. And heaven in what's down Orisdale Road, which is where the uh, joint station uh, used to be. And you can see that on this map. And um, so there's down the bottom right hand corner is the bridge. We're standing right on the tracks and behind us was the joint station. So we can spin the camera around now and have a look well, exactly how it is today. Uh, the road roughly matches the um, course of the railway line, um, roughly speaking, but it did go off to another bridge, which we're going to go to in a minute, where it joined onto the main line between uh, West Kirby and Bergenhead and through to Liverpool. But this is probably our best comparison angle with this picture here. Uh, the picture would have been taken a lot higher up um, on, the, on the bank, which doesn't exist anymore. Um, but this is probably the closest view that we've got to um, the joint West Kirby joint platform and the good yards to the left uh, that we can get. All this area is now, of course, is covered by the West Kirby uh, Concourse Leisure Centre swimming pool. Uh, we're now at the other end of the station, the other bridge, the other road bridge, uh, which still exists. In fact, it's quite a newly constructed roll road bridge. It's uh, been rebuilt uh, probably in the last year or so ago. And, and this is the closest we can get. Uh, there's fences and all sorts of stuff in the way now uh, to this, um, this picture. Now off to the left is up to the joint station that we are at earlier. You can probably just about see the platform over there. And we were over there filming back towards here. And of course these lines uh, joined up onto these lines here which still exist. In fact here's a Mersey Rail train heading off to Liverpool Central uh, as we speak um, so as you can see this whole area was um, one joint uh, connection off to the joint line to the left the station which is still there now on the right and a huge good yard in the middle and of course the the West Kirby concourse wasn't here at all um, in in this picture so we actually just come just down the hill a bit around from the bridge just to get a much clearer view um, of what we're talking about here so a slightly different angle than the picture we had before uh, train station off to our right the new supermarket uh, which is built here uh, but over to the left is where the joint line station would have been and we can almost see a straight line 
uh, straight. There's the road where we were before. We were just by that white van. And that's where the Wirral Way starts. So that road, almost straight line, replicates the um, line of the old railway. And another Mersey rail uh, comes in. Uh, so back to the original uh, picture at West Kirby Station, the frontage of the station. Uh, the first thing that strikes us um, comparing these two pictures is the, well, the bushes around the edge of the road, which weren't there um, originally. They've all grown, grown since. Um, whoever took the photo back then, I believe this is somewhere in the 50s or 60s maybe, maybe some more known one from that car uh, in the bottom right there to give us an idea. Also, it has the old British Railway um, West Kirby sign up there as well. Uh, but they've cut the clock off um, from the picture. So there's, there's clearly the clock on the uh, top of the tower there. And there's a Pelican Crossing in the picture as well. That's now replaced by these uh, very well used um, pedestrian lights over to the right over here. And speaking of just to the right, we have just this side road up the... Up the up the side there and to the right is the Crescent and we have this picture of it now and we'll go and have a look and see how that's changed. Now this around here in the uh, Crescent is a little, um, little quiet, uh, quiet road in West Kirby um, with plenty of uh, little shops in and the um, big thing we can notice here is that there's a canopy on the right hand side which is um, which is uh, which is gone. Not sure when that um, when that happened. Um, also on the left, there's the um, well, the post office has now took over the shop on the left, and they've put a canopy on. Uh, and you can see further down the street, you can see the the tops of the buildings are all the same. Um, well, that's the main thing that's changed here is lack of cars in the picture, and that canopy. And you can also see in the distance the uh, Tudor looking building on the far right and of course nowadays the whole row is filled with uh, with cars parked out shopping whereas back then there was merely two uh, but what we can do now is go back from the Crescent head back over to the station and let's go inside and have a look and see what we can find in there today and don't forget to have a look at our disused stations videos um, of the peninsula. We've got three parts to it and um, West Kirby features on part two uh, as well as the rest of the West Kirby to Hooton line uh, which closed in the 50s, 60s. So as this video features West Kirby train station, uh, let's have a look at this video down here, which is all about the station that was down in Heswell, further down this branch line. And another video up here, which is another What's It Like Now video.